Hello, welcome to Repurposing Junk with Mrs. Munson. And Lily and I are going to be showing you a project today with this meat grinder, which we got at an estate sale. And I like the meat grinder very much. It's got a great patina. And although I think it's a great meat grinder, Lily is not really intrigued with all its bumps and metal noises. So I'm gonna let her down and I'll show you um, how cool it is. Um, we paid five bucks for this. Some of them I paid about four, but this is a large one. And so five bucks was a fair price. Um, meat grinders were originally designed to hook on the counter like this. And you were just not a proper home in early times if you didn't have your meat grinder, making your sausages and all that. So um, it's become fashionable now to make this into a planter. So you put your soil in there and you can plant your sedums. And it's kind of a cute project. So I think that's why they're a little harder to find than they used to be. Um, we're gonna turn this meat grinder upside down like this. And that way we're not limited to just hooking it onto the side of a counter. I really like this project because it doesn't require quite as many tools as uh, some other um, lamp projects do. So this one is a pretty good project. You'll just need um, a hacksaw or saw in this bit off, but I'll show you all these details step by step and we'll show you the story of this um, from the beginning to ending. So stick around. This is the loot we just got at the estate sale and see two meat grinders which I'm excited about showing off on a video um, one was three one was five bucks this scale was five bucks we got these three very cool old books three for five bucks and this rusty old um, toolkit or toolbox is going to be um, sedum plant right video please hit the like button if you would like to see more videos like this hit the subscribe button thanks for watching